kickoff? I don't, you're embarrassing. Frank, where are we at? Florence. We're at Florence today. Come on, you have personality, show it. Okay, ready? Now talk to it. Hey all 200 of you guys, we're back at Florence Motor Speedway today, looking to run third again, or potentially knock the nose off for the third race in a row. And maybe a hood too. What are we gonna do today, Doug? I was told we already got gas this morning, first of all. And I got checked. Loaded. Yeah, but it's just weird. We only have five gallons of gas. Right? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I, I went to fill the car up. Yeah. Set him up. Yeah. 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 Mommy and Daddy are fighting. Oh, man, look. AJ's about to fight Matt. AJ is all calm. Calm down, man. Calm I'm not down. fucking calm. I'm just but it's Today we are at Florence Motor Speedway, and we have a big race today. If you win the race tonight, you get guaranteed the pole in the South Carolina 400, which is a huge race, and you could just completely eliminate the stress of, of having to qualify in because not everybody makes the race. If you've been following the channel for a while, we actually did win the last big race that they had here at uh, Florence. We won the icebreaker earlier this year. We do have some notable names on the entry list. Normally, I, I don't really talk too much about people that I race against, but we are racing against Dale Jr. again, which is pretty cool. We got him in the vlog two times ago, but you know, it's hard to get people on the vlog when everybody's doing their own thing. We're also competing too, so. We know what we came here to do. National points wise, we're not really worried about it no more. All right, we're just here to run races. I want to stay in good form for Martinsville, which is in three weeks. So I'm going to keep racing up until Martinsville. And then after that, I'm taking a long awaited break. We did do the morning practice and I think we were fifth, but I, I feel like we might have a leg up when it comes to this race because a lot of these guys only come here in the winter when there's a lot more grip. But we've been running the weekly shows with a lot of the regulars. I, I would honestly consider myself one of the regulars here at this point. And the track is way different. Like it's a lot more slicker. You can run the top the way that we've been running it. It's uh, insane. I hope to Honestly, if you have a good handling car, you don't need it, but it would be cool to break it out at some point tonight. This is, there's a lot of eyes on this race, and I, I would like to throw my name in contention. I think we have a good chance at it tonight, and I'm super excited to get into it. I'm also putting the comment here that won the shirt, so go ahead and hit me up on Instagram, and then I'll get a shirt to you. So make sure you leave a comment now for a chance to win a shirt in the next video. But even if you don't win, be sure to go to airdug.net and go get one for yourself. We got some new stuff, and we got hats coming soon. Let's get into the video. It's gonna be a busy day, but I'm super excited. Just break the camera. roll for qualifying our mock run sucked to be honest uh, I think we just had a faulty set of tires but we shall see uh, there's not really that many cars there's 21 cars but, but there's not as many as we thought there were gonna be you know, qualifying's not too important but I would just like to know that we got the issues out of the car so hopefully we can put on a good show in right here Let's have a good night and look at the, look at the rims I'm excited Whoa. all my homies love the red chromies let's get into it Now we thank you. 
So everything was moving along kind of fast, so I forgot to talk to the camera before the race started. But the way this race is pretty simple, it's going to be two stages. The first stage is going to be 97 laps, and then we come down pit road for a 15-minute break, and then the Bandoleros race 15 laps. And during that time frame, we can put on two tires wherever we want. And then the second stage that runs to the end of the race is going to be 53 laps, so 150 laps total. This race is kind of a nightmare to film for us because there's a ton of people there, and we didn't get a very good spot, so these people that are standing up in the beginning will We'll sit down eventually. So apologies for that, but let's jump into the race. Ladies and gentlemen, off your seat and on your seat, Air Doug is here. Keep it tight. Right, right, right. Still inside. You got the clear, clear, clear. Still inside. Got the momentum clear, clear, clear. Nice and easy now. It's an 1850. It's pretty quick. Don't let him press you. If he wants to go, let him go. Slap three. All single file behind you, right with you, 13. It's an 1890. It's much more like it. That's what we do. We're running our race. Looking inside. He's inside 13 by himself inside. Right now there's a hole. Clear, clear, clear. Clear by one over the 51. That was a uh, 1930. 191 clear by three over the 51 now. Back to lap nine. 20.1, 21 is looking inside. She's there by herself, clear down behind her. Still clear by one, two over the 51. This is a little excessive. Riding? Yeah, like how slow we're going. Well, nobody's pressuring you, so it's up to you. I mean, hell, there's no need. It's not like you're going to run 13 down right now. You come back to lap 15, the 95 just made a move behind you. He's uh, one back. He's clear by two over the 51. He's looking inside. He's there. We haven't raced this guy a whole lot. He looks like he's getting antsy, though. You're clear down behind him. The 51's five, three back. To let you do. You got 51, four back. Five back from him is a 91. Dale Jr. is a half a straightaway back from him, and then your brother is a straightaway back from that. So 1960 that lap, 80 previous, you were lap 30. Almost a straightaway gap now behind you. Clicking off 31. The 13th has got to be getting close to lapping people, yeah? So he's just now in the center of one and two. The first lap car's getting into three. So it's a straightaway gap before he's lapping people. Like the, the, the cars that were lagging way back at the Intel are trying to go now. So like Trent's four cars from Dale Jr., right? Dale Jr.'s a straightaway from you. There's two cars in between you. The 51's five back. 10 four, good feedback. 51's for in line right with you. So the rest of the field's starting to get pressure, so they're picking up the pace. The 91's a half straightaway behind you guys. Inside, inside, inside. Sorry he dove on you. He's by himself. You make the choice. Lap 38 here. So now you got the 91 and a half straightaway back, and they are picking up the pace somewhat. They probably just want to maintain what the 51 does. 51 runs a smart race here, so let's just kind of stick with him right here. It's a 1940 still. That's what's pretty much running behind you. Probably don't want to be on the bottom for the restart, yeah? Yeah, probably not. So right now you're P5, 13th about to straight ahead of everybody, and you got, you know, you're the three in front of you. Coming back to 37 to go, you'll have three, seven to go at the line. You're clicking off lap 79. So you're going to have 10 to go, but they're going to... Click 97, come back, and then one to get to 98. They're going to throw the yellow. It's so really 11 to go here. Does he have a gap behind him? 28. He's got a straightaway gap behind him, yeah. Can we give it to him so we can be sick? Probably wouldn't be a bad idea if he'll take it. Fifth is uh, not that good. He's still got seven to go. Yellow's out. Slow down. Keep it low, 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 low right here. All right, buddy, one to go. Make sure everything's where you need to clean them up good. You're going to have four lap shootout. You run until I tell you to stop. 10-4. Roger. Green, 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 green. You're clear. Uh, he's clear 
clear up, clear up if you want it, clear up if you want it, still clear up. Side by side behind you. And the O3 in your lane. Still clear up. Still outside. You're coming back to lap 97, but you're going to have to finish this lap. Run up hard. He just fucked up. Run up hard. All right, buddy, good job. Honestly, I think I'm better than I initially thought we were, so I, I wanted to stay on the bottom. It's a pretty good lane down here. <laughs> We have done a good job so far. Let's get up on it and close it out. Clean up good. Get knock the new off of it. Feel, your feel how your brakes are stopping. It might feel a little different now. They're a little cooler. Everything's rolling. Still up there, 28. Still up there. Holds up, clears up if you want it. Bottom's moving. Stay down there. Come on. Come on, come on. They got her all jacked up. Get up there and take advantage of it. Oh, bottoming out real hard, buddy. Come on. Still out there. Run it hard. Still out there. Still there. Still there. Just her. Come on. It's still out there. Let's get through this corner good. You'll get clear. Still there just barely. Clear, clear, clear. Come on. Bring it to the wall. 95 in your lane. Side by side behind you. Beautiful. Clear by half. 95 is running hard. Keep running it hard. One and two is better than his one and two. Let's try to roll the center a little quicker down here. He's looking inside. He's by himself. You guys got a half straight on the next guy. Back to clear. Still down in the bottom lane. Clear. Back down inside by himself again. You got a half straightaway gap behind you. You and him. Clear. Flat 105. These guys are running the fuck out of it. I don't know where we're run them down, so just keep maintaining. Don't don't kill it. Come out of the corner, just in case of a, a late restart or something like that. I feel confident that there'll be a late restart. Just race like that. All right, still a full straightaway behind you. But Briscoe just got to fifth. I'll tell you if he's coming right now. The gap's the same. Right with you. Where he edges, where he's killing us. Still in line. Inside, inside, by himself, way by himself. job done and almost has Barnes clear off of two. And I gotta say the battle behind him. Oh, we got one car that is off at the top. Is that Glinsky? Yeah, that's Glinsky. He went just a bit too far. Glinsky is off the racetrack. Green, good green, green, good green. Clear behind him if you want it, but I wouldn't take it. Still clear behind him.
Still clear up. Inside. With no momentum, you're all clear. Oh, fuck. Come on, you're all right. All clear. Chase Briscoe, oh, Barnes just went a little too high. I was talking to him earlier today. He said Glinski taught him a thing or two, but if you go off just a little bit, you're going to be in trouble. And he did a great job of bringing that car back, but Dale Earnhardt Jr. is able to take advantage. Coming back to the checkered. Yeah, it's fucked up thing. The toe's not really fucked up. So we just wrapped up the race. It was a good time, man. It was kind of, I don't know, un uneventful, to be honest, because it's like... The first 60 laps reminded me of the 400 two years ago where we're just pedaling around running 20 second lap times. But uh, I just didn't have the center cut that you know, the guards in front of me did. And then I about drove off into the woods. I was having a problem with my with my brake bias and I can't tweak on it. So I was like really losing the ass for an entry. But for some reason, I, if I would go to what my normal front is to settle it down, it would either double up on the rear or if I went to the other side, it would go to the rear as well. So I don't know if I was too far one way or what. So I about wound up in the woods on my own air. I mean, man, it's a it's a good time. And uh, to be honest, I probably wouldn't have even ran this weekend if Lawrence wasn't having a big event. I just wanted to support them. So, I mean, it was a good time. Like I said, I, I came in here stress-free and that's exactly what this race was, stress-free. So normally I'd be kicking myself because I threw away a top five and finished seventh, but Really, the only thing that you get is winning here. So, with that being said, Electric Car Race is about to start, so it's gonna get loud. If you're new to the channel, be sure to subscribe, give the video a thumbs up, and I'm not sure when we're gonna see you next, but we'll see you soon.